double murder suspect is out on bond tonight. Derek Yancey is accused of killing his wife, Linda Yancey, and day laborer, Marcial cox Paluk back in June. Fox News' Angelique Proctor is live at the DeKalb County Jail tonight with the latest on his release. Angelique? Well, Russ, Derek Yancey left the jail this afternoon. His release continues to surprise a whole lot of people and anger Linda Yancey's family. Derek Yancey met all of the rigorous requirements of his $150,000 bond today and was escorted by the DeKalb County Sheriff's Office to his mother's home in Jonesboro. The double murder suspect will remain on house arrest here in Clayton County wearing an ankle monitor at all times. Judge Ann Workman pointed to Yancey's willingness to turn himself in and his strong family ties as partial reasons for the bond. The judge restricted his movements to medical appointments and attorney visits. Still many courthouse observers are amazed the 49-year-old was granted bond after being accused of killing his wife Linda and day laborer Marcielle cox Paluk. An attorney for Linda's family members tells Fox 5 this release reeks of preferential treatment as a result of his previous employment with the DeKalb County court system. The career lawman called police to his home June 9th. He told officers day laborer Paluk shot and killed Linda during a robbery attempt. So he shot Paluk to defend his wife. Police questioned the story and charged the former deputy with two counts of murder. His attorney says DeKalb police have made wrong assumptions in the case. Mr. Yancey did not murder his wife. Mr. Yancey was forthcoming and told him what happened. And as this case plays out in the court of law, that's exactly what you'll see. Now, Derek and Linda the Yancey had two sons. One is eight, the other is 18. It's safe to say that there is a battle brewing tonight over custody of that eight-year-old by both of those families. Reporting live from Decatur, Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News. Angelique, thanks.